Hello, everyone. Hello, hello, hello. This is Shanice M. Wise, your business expansion coach and strategist, uh, welcoming you to my video on how to expand your business virtually during a global crisis. Ooh, right? So how to expand your business virtually during a global crisis. So I'll wait for a few of you to join. To, so to all my business owners, all my CEOs, all my entrepreneurs, all of my aspiring entrepreneurs, please share this out. Please share this, share this, share this to your page. Um, I am offering a free virtual class, okay? So for those of you who follow me and know me, I've been in business for 17 plus years and I teach business owners how to expand. All right, that is the goal, especially right now during everything that's going on. So please share. I wanna see a million shares because this is an opportunity for you to think about additional ways to grow your business while you're stuck at home, um, while you're not able to really be around all your friends and your family, and for those of you business owners who are like, what am I about to do? Because the governor is shutting down everything. No matter what state you're in, you're seeing that, you know, things are being shut down. Things are being shut down. We just saw that salons were closing or were closed. We just, you know, I have clients that are restaurant owners closed. So I just don't want you to get to a place where you think that, your business is going to sink. Okay. So share, share, share. Um, this video is going to lead you to um, the opportunity to register for a free virtual uh, uh, class. It's limited seating because I'm a very relationship based uh, person. So in this class, it'll be conversations. It'll be me um, um, speaking with you, sharing information with you, all that good stuff. Thank you for my thumbs up and for my hearts. Um, so share, share, share. And I'm going to go ahead and get started. All right. All right. So follow me, follow me, follow, follow me. So whether you are a new business owner or an existing business owner, I'm sure you and your business have been affected directly or indirectly by the outbreak of the coronavirus. OK, COVID-19. This virus has hit our entire country and it continues to spread. And, you know, they said that we haven't even seen the worst yet. OK. So I get it and I understand your stress. I was on the phone with my um, my clients last week, just giving them strategies, giving them plans of actions. I want them to know that I'm in it with them and I don't want them to feel like this is the end all. Lord, what am I going to do? I wanted to make sure that they have plans of action, strategies in order to take their business um, to the next level so they can create. See, this is a season and a time of strategy. OK, so my 11 year old son is home from school and I've seen all these different things with kids who are home and he has no idea when school will re will, it will, will when it will reopen. You know, so how many of you are listening right now? You have children home and you're trying to manage your business. You're trying to, you know, do your work. You're trying to make sure that they're doing what they're supposed to be doing. Listen, I know it's a lot, okay? My godson and my cousin will not get to attend their proms or their graduations because of what's going on. We all know that. We see it. There are business owners that are connected to me in so many ways, family, friends, clients that have truly been affected by the virus. And this is something, y'all, that we never expected. We didn't expect for this. We wasn't looking for this. It just happened. And as a generation, we never thought something like this would affect us in such a devastating way. You know what I mean? We have no idea what the uh, global, when it will end, when the global crisis will end. And some are predicting that it might last until the summer. And that goes into a lot of travel. It goes into weddings, um, bridal showers, baby showers. I mean, um, work conferences, events. I mean, I could go on and on and on. So honestly, no one, not even the scientists, knows what's going to happen. Business owners' contracts are being cut. Restaurants are being closed. Bus business owners are sending home employees with no definite day of return. The business owner must continue. I want you to hear this. So for all of y'all who know business owners out there, all of you who know business owners out there, if you can 
um, bless them or do whatever. Listen, business owners still have to, to pay their expenses. With all that I just said, they still have to uh, pay their expenses, okay? They have to pay their employee salaries. So the economic impact of this virus, it is enormous. It's enormous. So the reason why I wanted to bring this class is because not as just as a business expansion coach and strategist, but also as a Christian who has a heart to serve. I love the Lord. I love Jesus. And I've been seeking God for answers on what I can do to help business owners during this difficult time. OK, I've really, really been sitting with God. So you haven't seen me come on here with videos. You haven't seen me do a whole bunch of stuff, because before I put it out here, I wanted to make sure that what I am offering you is going to be of need, what you need right now. OK, so I'm going to say that again as a business coach, but also as a Christian and I have a heart to serve ministry is what I do. I've been seeking God on what I can do to help business owners right now during this season, during this difficult time. So I want business owners to hear me. Please hear me. This is not a time for panic. It is a time for strategy. All right. It is not a time. And if you have if you have if you're in a place where you can take notes, if you um, you know, uh, you may be driving. So don't stop. But if you're if you're somewhere in your office, in your home, if you have your cell phone, write this down. This is not a time for panic. This is a time for strategy. And I am a strategist. And what I'm doing right now with my clients who are in my coaching programs, I am teaching them how to expand their business virtually. OK, so this workshop, this virtual class is titled how to expand your business virtually during a global crisis. That is what we are in. This is not this virus is not just affecting the United States. Y'all seen China shut down. I mean, countries are shutting down, but that does not mean that you cannot still run your business. OK, so let's go. Let's go. A virtual business relies on the Internet and telecommunications. And right now we still have the Internet. We still have telecommunications. Both startup and overhead costs are very low because you're not paying for a physical location. And some of you who are listening, you already have a virtual business. Well, guess what? We can take it to another level. Again, my title is expansion. So I can teach you how to expand. So this is a huge trend for the present as well as for the future. It's important for business owners to take advantage of this now. OK, so here what I'm saying, you are home. You are trying to figure out what to do as a business owner. OK. Everything that you do right now, because seasons change, I need you to understand that seasons change. So, yes, we're in a global crisis right now, but it will not always be this way. Seasons will change what you do as a business owner right now has the opportunity to affect your bottom line when this season changes. So Shanice, what are you saying? I am saying that if you develop a virtual, just, and I'm not telling you to develop a different business. I am telling you, and I'm gonna give you some examples in a minute, develop an additional stream of business that connects to your current business. Y'all let me know if you're understanding what I'm saying. Give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment. But developing another stream of business to generate revenue that leads back to your current business. OK, I'm going to go in more details. Just follow me. So for those of you who don't quite understand how this can be done or what to do to get started, my course, my class, and this is the first of many different free virtual classes that I'm going to offer you will help you. OK, so my virtual um, class is going to teach you how to properly set up an online business that uses your expertise and it connects back to your current business. So I'm not telling you to be an event planner than to be a real estate agent. I am teaching you how to use what you already have. Thank you for my heart and expand it. All right. OK, so it will connect back to your business. It does not matter whether you desire to create a new business or to expand your current business, okay? 
this can help you. This virtual, this solid virtual branch of business connects you to your business and it allows additional revenue. Who cannot right now use additional revenue? I bet everyone that is listening, everyone that will hear this video can use some additional revenue. We have no idea what's coming up, but God has given us wisdom. He's given us discernment. Okay. And he's given us gifts. Everybody listening to me right now has a special, unique gift that you're already using inside of your business. So let's use it to expand virtually. OK, so for an example, follow me. If you're a real estate agent during this time, OK, and it's difficult for you to get out there and show houses. It's important that you know that there's other ways to use your expertise online. And this is what this workshop virtual class, whatever you want to call it, is going to show you. If you're an event planner, restaurant owner, author, life coach, business coach, you own a fitness center, this virtual class will explain the importance of successfully setting up virtual businesses online that generate revenue. I'm not going to just teach you how to do things and give them away for free. I'm going to teach you how to set this up, how to build relationships, how to expand what you already have. And guess what? If you do this now, when the season changes, you're going to be so grateful to God that you decided to step out. And everyone listening to this, they're not going to register. Everyone listening to this will be like, I already got it going on. Those are, those are the people that you really need to be skeptical of because there's always room for you to grow and learn. You don't know everything. I don't know everything. That's why, that's why I'm connected with people who know more than me. You should be connected to people who know more than you. Okay. So here's the thing, write this down. You do not have to be stuck. You don't have to feel helpless and you don't have to watch your business hit rock bottom. You don't have to be stuck right now. You don't have to feel helpless and you don't have to watch your business hit rock bottom. Do not give up too quickly without looking for alternative ways of operating that empire that you have. And unbeknownst to many business owners, there are a variety of ways to expand your business. Okay. So here are key points. Here are some key points. So write them down. You know, I love to educate. I want to see business owners win. I, at the end of the day, that is for 17 years. That's where my heart and my passion has been for business owners that are really serious about moving and expanding to the next level. So when setting up a virtual business online, it's important for you to understand, number one, the best practices and how to share your expertise virtually. All of you have some type of expertise. OK. But how you share it virtually is very important. It's not just you getting on here doing a Facebook Live. It's not just you offering a service. There are things on the back end that you need to do in order to make this possible. Then you need to know what companies to use that have demonstrated the most success in the virtual arena. There are companies out there that have failed. There are, there are companies out there that are very successful. Thank you for keep sending my thumbs up. I know you're still with me. Okay. So also number three, how to set up strategic sales funnels. A sales funnel is important because it takes your target audience, your ideal client from point A all the way to point Z where they actually pay, spend money with you, they invest and they fall in love with you. Okay. So when setting up a virtual business is also important to, to understand a strategic sales funnel. That's so important. And there's a lot of companies out there right now that are offering um, different things um, and teaching you how to set, to, to set up a strategic sales funnel. But guess what? In this workshop, we're going to walk through it in this class, which is free. All you have to do is register, but it is limited seating. You'll get this. Also, here's another important area, how to calculate your numbers. How many people will you need to speak with in order to close your sale virtually? Virtual is different than, than in person. And right now, many business owners cannot be in person, right? So you have to do it virtually. And then finally, when setting up a virtual business online, it's important to understand your messaging and your content that needs to be shared in order to attract your target audience 
Who is your target audience? Your target audience are those who you provide a solution to for their problem. And at the end of the day, as a business owner, that's the only way you get clients is because you provide a, sol a solution to their problem, okay? So yes, the process for successfully creating a virtual online business may be intense, but that's why I'm holding this class to educate you and to get you set up for success, all right? But listen, the potential for success, even after this season, this virus has passed, it's amazing for you, and I'll say it again, for the bottom line of your business, okay? You have the potential to create a stream of income that would not have, you wouldn't even have thought about it or acted on it if this virtual, if this virus did not exist. So your home is time to strategize. OK, um, you know, and at the end of the day, you would not have thought about the different things that I'm going to teach you in this class if we were not in this place. And it's not just me in this situation. It's not just the person, you know, that may live next to you. Everybody is affected by this. All right. So finally, at the end of the day, if you are a believer and those of you who follow me, yes, I'm a business coach. But number one, I love the man above, okay? If you are a believer and you trust God, you have to show faith during this difficult time. Now, I'm still saying use wisdom. Follow what they're saying. Stay home. Respect other people. Respect yourself. Wash your hands. Do what the government and the officials are telling us. That does not mean that you don't have faith. That means that you're listening and you're using wisdom and God gives us wisdom. Remember the word says that we walk by faith and not by sight. You, me, we, we may not be able to see the end of the result, but we must trust God through the process because let me tell you something, no matter if you believe or not, he is still yet in control. I want to say that to you again. If you are a believer and you really truly trust God, show faith during this time. Remember the word says that we walk by faith and not by sight. We, we, we may not be able to see the end results of what's going to happen, but we must trust God through the process because he's still in control and you must use wisdom. So for those of you who have uh, been on here with me who have listened to me share about this virtual work class uh, workshop virtual class that i'm very excited about how to expand your business virtually during a global crisis no matter if you are a new business owner if you are um, aspiring to be a business owner or you are established i don't care where you're at this will be a great virtual class for you so join me on tuesday march 31st i want to give you all time to register at 7 p.m eastern for this virtual class, okay? You can only register for yourself. So if you know other business owners, send them the link in the um, description, okay? So what is the focus of this, of this virtual class? Number one, what does a virtual workspace look like and what key programs you can use, okay? So I'm gonna talk to you and I'm gonna share with you and I'm gonna give you visual aid on what a virtual workspace does look like and what are some programs that you can use to help build out this stream of business, okay? We're also going to talk about how expanding your business virtually can potentially add additional six figures to your income. Because remember, you're preparing right now for the future. So you come out of this thing looking sweet with all your other business streams. When that restaurant work opens back up, when you can get back out there and do your event planning, when you can get back out there and do your thing, which you already do, this is an extra branch for you because you were strategic, okay? And then lastly, in this, work, in this class, we're gonna talk about three steps to take when identifying what part of your expertise to share virtually. So I'm sure you got a whole bunch of things that you do inside of your business. Well, it's important for you to identify what piece of that do you want to share virtually to begin to educate other people who want to do what you do? Who want to do and develop what, you know, 
Some of you who are watching this video, you are amazing at what you do as business owners and people are watching you. Do you think they don't want to learn from you? And I say this all the time, the gifts that the Lord has given you, they're not for you, they're for other people and it's meant for you to serve. This is going to be an amazing time for you to be able to serve. Don't you truly believe that God blesses you when you serve others? And he's so amazing that his word says that he can do, he's able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we could think or imagine. So get excited about this opportunity right now. So again, how to expand your business virtually during a global crisis. This is a free virtual workshop. It is on Tuesday, March 31st at 7 o'clock p.m. You can register today. There is limited seating, okay? It is a virtual, so y'all will see me, and I'm going to teach you to the wheels fall off, and we're going to talk about what does a virtual workspace look like for you and what programs that you need to use based on what it is you do, how expanding a, your business virtually can add an additional six figures to your income, and three steps to take when identifying what part of your expertise to share virtually. So thank y'all, everyone who were, was here, who was listening. Please share this. Again, seating is limited. Um, there will be a wait list. I, I haven't decided if I'm going to open the wait list up or not. And I am sharing this on every single social media platform that I'm on and my email distribution list. So I'm telling you, Seating is limited. Go on and register and don't register just to register. I only want people in this virtual class who is serious about this time and not giving up, walking by faith and strategically developing an additional source of business, of revenue in order to take their, their company, their business, their empire to the next level. So again, join me on Tuesday, March 31st at 7 o'clock p.m. Um, in this workshop, I'm going to be giving away materials that I would not normally give away because I know that is needed right now. I'm going to be sharing tips that I normally only give my clients that are in my coaching programs. So it's a must if you're a business owner trying to figure it out or aspiring or new, register and register today. Tell your girlfriend about this um, virtual class. Tell other business owners that you know because it's going to be important for their success. I cannot say if, if I'm going to offer this class again, because I have a whole list of classes that I'm going to offer during this season. So register today. So again, this my name is Shanice M. Wines. I am a business expansion coach and strategist. Thank you for joining me. Just know that I love you. I'm here for you. Um, and I'm trusting God with you because I know that seasons come and seasons go, but it's all about what we do during the season. So thank y'all. Share it. Um, and thank you for everyone who joined.